I'm uh, Luca Bernard, so obviously I'm French, and I'm from France, from Paris, and my um, film is about um, a cop um, nearly retiring who is uh, looking for a thief which specifically uh, st still stole a uh, piece of art, paintings more precisely. And he, he always come by the roof in the houses to take uh, paintings not too expensive, but... Uh, Still value, valuable, though. And what is the title of the film? A Clever Crook. Clever Crook, yes. How's the film called in French, actually? Un beau voyou. <laughs> Sounds interesting. Why do you want to tell this story? What is so interesting about a thief collecting artwork? It's a... Uh, <laughs> I think that the first, the first image of the film was someone walking on the roof. Because uh, when you are in Paris, when, when you are in a big city, you can't see the horizon uh, unless you go on the roof. And uh, so there, there was at first a very, um, uh, very aesthetic uh, idea. There was too the, the idea that this guy who go by the roof is uh, crossing boundaries, playing with the rules because um, uh, visually, he plays with the rules because he don't he don't follow the ways of the other, uh, like the streets or the doors, etc. And so the story is this cop who is going to um, to, to to follow this man on the roof. In fact, so uh, at first it began. Uh, you have to he's in the streets and he go by stairs, and after more and more, it can go by the roof. Sounds like a very interesting idea. How was shooting process for this film? Has it been challenging, especially shooting on the roofs? Well, yeah, uh, shooting on the roof was very challenging. The more challenging thing was that um, uh, Tom Cruise was uh, filming uh, in Mission Impossible, Impossible Mission, uh, the fourth or the fifth in Paris. And so it was quite hard because we have to, to split Paris in, in two, one for, for Tom Cruise and one for us. And uh, obviously, it took a, a big, big part of Paris. So at first, we had to. It was a bit of hide and seek with Tom Cruise to 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 have the possibility to shoot when he wasn't there. So it was very fun. Uh, the second second problem when when you have to shoot on a roof is uh, that you need an authorization. So you you need to find uh, a roof that you can shoot on. So yeah. There is a problem of uh, if you are uh, in France, it's copropriété. Uh, if you are many owners of the of the of the of the uh, building, you have to see every one of them. And after that, uh, there is just the problem of uh, doing the scene. Well, then after everything, um, our audience in Braunschweig has already seen your main actor, the thief, in last year in Bloody Milk, in a yes. very interesting film. How was work with this actor for you? It was it was very very fun. In fact, uh, because he likes to, to enjoy himself uh, in playing, and uh, it's it's a way of working I uh, I enjoy too. So uh, it has always been very very cool to work with him for that. Your film is nominated for the Audience Award, the Heinrich, and also for the Volkswagen Financial Services Award. Um, you screened your film already in France, I guess. How have been how have reactions been there? The French pu publicum, how does it like it? Uh, it was good relations. The, the better was when uh, we, we, um, we uh, there was uh, school school boys and school girls who watched the film uh, at the very beginning of the. Uh, so, uh, attends, comment dit ça? Mm, les lycéens. There was a, a festival in France with a lot of uh, young people, and uh, it was a very very cool screening. This one because they uh, lost a lot extra, but uh, yeah. It was cool. <laughs> <laughs> so now your first screening is running right now. Are you excited for the Q and A's afterwards? You have three sold out screenings here in Braunschweig, which is amazing. Yeah, well, it's the first time I do a Q and A not in French, so uh, it is a, it is a, it is a first, a premiere for me, and uh, I don't know at all how the, the German uh, public can uh, can um, can see the movie. So it's very, very interesting for me to uh, discover that. Talking about our festival and its audience, how's your impression so far from the festival? You just arrived, like you said, but what is the first impression you have? 
It's the first time I come to Germany, so uh, I, I don't understand uh, a word of what is uh, said, so uh, it's very, very, very exotic, in fact, for me, and uh, so this is pleasant. I hope that you still like it, even though you don't understand a word. So, uh, last question so far, do you have any further projects coming up? When are we able to see A Clever Crook here in Germany? Uh, I have two, uh, yeah, I have two films, uh, I'm working on two films right now. Completely different one from another. Uh, the first one is uh, is about uh, a woman who vanished, and the second one is uh, is uh, how do you say a rom com in comedy romantic in a submarine. In a submarine. Interesting. So we're very excited about this. Thank you very much for being here with us. Thank you for ha having brought this wonderful film to us, and I hope you enjoy your time here in Braunschweig. Thank you very much.